Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Jesus, it's been a while. Um, but yeah, um, today I'm going to be recording the um, Perico heist that's recently come to GTA. Um, so it's basically just a heist. Um, you should rob an island. Um, a lot of people have been saying it's really hard, but if you guys want to like just watch this and it's easier than you think, trust me. Um, yeah, that's really about it, but like. So when you do it, the submarine cost um, two mil, um, which isn't bad. Um, the arcade costs more, and you can do this solo and get about a mil each mission. And the preps aren't even that hard either. The only hard one is the submarine one, um, in my opinion. Um, but most of them are just optional. But really, with this technique that I do, you're not really going to need it. So what I do is um, you're going to see right now. You go to the, you go to the drainage tunnel um, which you could scope out um, near the compound um, when you first went well when you go around and you look at all the points when you first start and you can go back and keep doing it but yeah so you want the drainage tunnel which will get you into the compound straight away um, the, I think going in sneaky with this is probably the best option people are saying um there's a big conversion of it but i just it i it's just not really the best i only go um i don't go for the secondary targets i only go for the first one because trust me um it's a lot easier when you're doing it solo and you get about a mil each mission which is pretty good um one of my mates do that and all so yeah you're gonna need um the drill which is basically just going to drill you through like this it's pretty easy well it is easy it's not the hardest that's the only bit like you, it goes a bit quick so you need to just go back but it doesn't take too long to do there you go we're in So I think I'm getting 900k from this, um, which is almost a mil. I don't know. Right, so then we just choose this point to go in, which you just open this up. I've done this quite a few times. Um, after this, I'm probably going to get 5 mil, which is quite good for this game. You can get quite a lot of stuff with 5, five mil. Right. So you just follow the steps here. It's pretty simple. I go with a marksman loadout because I just have. I just find it works for me. Right then, you want to watch out for this guy here. He's just gonna walk down here. Right, you want to shoot him through trees. Right, then you just want to run. Just gonna run without. Oh no, I'm stuck on chair. Right, you just want to run down here. Right, run up here, right, this is probably the hardest bit right here. What you've got to do is, there's two guys here, you've got to take them out. You've got to shoot one in head and shoot the other. It's pretty easy, but it's quite hard, like that. That's, in my opinion, the hardest part. Um, But, yeah, once you're in, it's really easy to get out. So that's just a guy talking, but... There's a guy coming here. Don't do this though, what I've just done. Because I forgot about him. I just missed a shot. Right, that was so lucky that no one heard that. Right, there's usually a guy around this corner. About round there. So, just got to slowly walk. Just take him out. It's pretty easy. Yeah, I, it's quite hard if you do the secondary targets. But I don't know why you'd really want to do that, to be fair. Um, I guess you get 4 mil from the end of it. Oh no, I did that wrong. But, just, I just, it, you've got to wait after this anyway. It's just easy. it. Right, you want to open this up and all you get a bit more pay. Right, that's El Rubio talking right there. It don't mean out, so you should carry on. Later, he usually comes in a chopper, but you'll be way long gone by then if you do get right. 
Right, I'm very, very bad at this. I'm not the best at it. What you want to do is you just want to look at what matches up and then just look. It's... I used to be really, really bad at it. I'm better at it now than I used to be, but I'm not the best still. Does that look about right? No. Back there. Right. Let me go. It's quite hard. It looks harder than it actually is, but... Still. That looks about right. No. Hmm. I think it's that. You've got um, three, four minutes to do this, by the way. So it's not the best amount of time, but. Hmm, yep. Hmm. Well, there we go. Right. That was the quickest time of me doing that, by the way. Jesus Christ. Right, that's what it does when you've done it, basically. Right. And then you just want to head in the, ele um, the elevator. Just go down, just run straight away, because there's a guy down there, but... Pretty easy. Right, there you are. You're done. That's the hardest part done. You're in. Right, then you just... It depends what you've got. Sometimes you'll get a safe code. Which Pavel will... Um, you'll just go... He'll send you the code. Just take a photo of it on your phone and... Look at it. He'll send you a code for the safe. But with these you just need the... Plasma cutter. And then you just cut it out. The ones in there. The ones behind the cage. I hate this set. I like it, but it's a plasma cut a bit that annoys me because I always go a bit too far and overheat it. You. That overheating. It's pretty easy to go in undetected and get out undetected and all. I'm going a bit too fast. I'm you want it gently press down on R2 on PlayStation. I don't know what it is on Xbox. Um, lightly. No. It'll just get you. Right, there we go. We're in. Right, just grab that. Right, we're at. Right. 900k. Just get out. The next bit I don't think a lot of people know about. You just swim. Right, you'll see what I mean. You just walk out straight away. Um, careful though. There's usually not anyone at the bottom of here, but if there is, just take them out. But I don't think there is for me. Um, so you just, yeah, just run. I think this is better than the casino heist. I do not miss the prep at all for the casino heist. At all. Because... Right, take him out. Right, it's usually get right. Just wait until he stays still. Oh god, I thought he st I thought he stopped then. Right, this is my escape point here. Right. Oh, right. So this is pretty easy. Usually with this, you can get um, the elite challenge done. Get it under 15 minutes. I know it's tempting to like steal the weed and stuff like that, but there's no point. Well, there is. If you're with a lot, if you're with like four people, I don't know what to do with that. But on PlayStation at the moment, the invite system's a bit glitched. So, yeah. But um. By the way, guys, I'm gonna do another. Um, I'm gonna do another video out soon.
but then I'm probably just going to leave it for a few months like I always do. Right. Don't worry about that, by the way, over there. And fall, just fall down or jump down. It's up to you, whatever your character does, really. You Sometimes it falls, sometimes it just goes down. They just swim. Don't swim to the checkpoint, just swim straight in front of you. Because it'll end up getting done. And you can usually get it done under 15 minutes doing this. I think... I'm going to get it under 15. See, I've lost no team lives. So, it'll start and say in a minute that El Rubio's helicopter... Well, El Rubio's in his copter looking for you. Because um, he knows. Um, just stand detected, but you're well gone. You you de you just out of there. You don't even know you who you are or where you are. So, yeah, but I can see it on the map there. See... He's trying to look for us, but yeah, he's about there. The wedge long gone. You only need to worry about that if you're going for weed. It's up. It's completely up to you. Like the what else is that? It, weed's one of them. Um, there's quite a few other stuff actually. I think you can get diamonds. I don't know. Um, I don't really go for secondary targets. Neither does my mate. Um, but yeah, it's really it. Um, oh, and also, if you're on GTA at all today, it has been, it's finally snowing for the Christmas update, which is pretty good. It's going to take a while swimming down here, but trust me, um, it's way easier than going all the way up for what's it called. The, um, the boat at the main dock. Choose main dock, just choose main dock as your exit point, but just don't go for it, just do what I'm doing, just swim right to the edge of the map and then it just it blanks out oh right oh, we're going up against right, just go back down it should nearly be done I enjoy the new heist. I think it's better than the casino one, mainly because I have um, I joined. I was start playing GTA in the middle of the casino one, but yeah, I'm gonna get five mil by the end of that. I got four mil there if you look. I think actually from this you might get 800k because it they're gonna take some of it and all. Like Pavel and what's it called? Right there, you go just swimming, then just blank. Then you're done. Then, yeah, that's it. You're done. You're done. You don't need to get a boat or anything like that. You don't need to, you swim. I didn't know that, but I was told that. It's honestly, that's honestly the best way to do it. And I got that under 15 minutes, I'm pretty sure. Right there, because that, that's some money in there. Right. We're done. Platinum. Right, that that's what you'd get if you went for the secondary targets, but just me don't. That's what we got. That's quite good. You get that. Doing the casino heist with your mates. Real, well, if you split it 50-50 usually. If you and one of your friends are doing it. Just you two. That thingy. I don't know, um, I don't know, people, some people do back to back, I don't really do back to back, um, we, I just play it and just get the money, um, just grind again, there we go, see it's snowing, it's Christmas, bit of my Christmas outfit there, but yeah, that's it, alright, I'll see you at next one.